like disease type you know like sick twisted type like stuff that could actually happen but we don't even think it could happen but i believe it could happen hold up hold up hold up welcome back to my channel what going on what are you saying what's up Ayo? what going on let me know let me know in the comments let me know how i am doing during this you know the quarantine i hope i am washing your hands staying safe you know if you're an essential worker i'm praying for you because i can't I'm praying for you, but I can't do it. But I'm praying for you. Netflix and all of that. I got you right now, cause right about now I want to tell you ten shows. This is gonna be my Netflix shows video, and then I'll do a Netflix movies video. So if you want a Netflix movies, we could do Netflix movies. But this one is my Netflix series video. What? So I want to give you some series that i watched before and that i like they might be old they might be new i don't know if you never watched them you watch them already that's okay but it might have some that you never watch because i just be watching weird stuff sometimes so before we get into this video though like comment and subscribe don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel because if you're not subscribed by now then you have a problem. The problem ain't me, the problem is you, obviously, because it's just to hit a button. Because we home now and like quarantine, whatever the case may be, we gonna need to watch some shows. So Netflix is my baby. That's like, honestly, like if you texted me and we talking, I'll be like, what are you doing watching Netflix? That's all I'll be doing now is watching Netflix. When I tell you shows, movies, I don't just be finding stuff and just watching it. And then people will be like, well, where you where you find that from? I'm like, I don't just be watching stuff. Now, I don't like when people will tell me to watch something on Netflix. I don't like it. Because I want to be able to find it on my own and be like, oh, I should watch this. So that's what I do. Like if I, f I feel like when you tell me to watch something, I am not going to watch it. Cause then I'll be like, okay, well. I don't know, it's weird. But like when somebody tell me to watch something, I don't want to watch it. I don't put it in my list. But it's not likely that I would watch it. <laughs> I just like to find stuff on my own, stuff that people wouldn't normally watch sometimes. Um, but yeah, so I have my um, sticky notes to say what I'm watching so I can remember. So the first one is The Island. If you never watched that, watch it. That's, that's a crazy, it's a limited series though. So, Let me tell you, that show, some sick, twisted stuff, okay? If you never watch it, go watch it. So my second one is Good Girls. Um, a lot of people know about this show already, but that's a good show too. Um, go watch it if you watch it. Okay, so this one is like really, really old, so a lot of people probably know about it. But if you never like decide you're gonna watch it because they have so much seasons, you stupid. Cause why? You have nothing else to do. Go watch it. So this one is the Vampire Diaries and the originals. So you gotta watch the Vampire Diaries. I, I suggest right. I watch the whole of Vampire Diaries and then I watch the originals when they have come out. Cause the originals didn't come out when the Vampire Diaries come out. So I advise you to watch the Vampire Diaries and when it reach to where they introduce the originals go watch the originals and then come back and watch the vampire the rest of the Vampire Diaries if not just watch the whole lot of Vampire Diaries and then 
go watch the originals and then i never watched the legacies yet i hear people say it's stupid and i have it in my list and i was ready to watch it but i'm like if people say it's stupid i don't want to waste my time like watching it you know so the next one is full of house i never really watched full house like when you know it was on tv but full house i watched full house so I don't think you really need you don't really need to watch Full House to watch Full House because Full House is just this is basically the spin-off of the children them that grew up and got their own family still living in the house. So yeah, you can watch that one. Next one is this is an old one too, Jane the Virgin. If you never watched that, watch it. That show is lit. Lit. Now I got into some like science type like disease type you know like sick twisted type like stuff that could actually happen but we don't even think it could happen but i believe it could happen because you know so this one is called the rain this only got two seasons i think but the rain dash this series it's like bird box but you know is different but it's kind of like you know like bird box and then them other stuff but yeah but it's different it's a different concept so the rain is a really really good one i would advise anybody to watch it it's really good and next one if you like if you're into like zombie um shows and stuff like that watch black summer it only have i think it's one season or two i don't know i don't remember one season or two black summer let me talk proper black summer watch that if you into you know zombies and stuff like that i i like zombie movies and series and stuff like that so you would enjoy this too now i just recently watched this and i said i gonna watch it again because it was so when i tell her that <laughs> i watched this series in like two days probably two three days two days i would say two three i don't know you know what i mean but anyways this is binge worthy shows you could literally just watch these in like and then done so this one is called containment when i tell her yo this that series had me hooked it had me hooked i used to just want to wake up just to watch this i didn't want to go i went sleep when it was i think i was coming up on like the last couple episodes and i actually stay up no never mind that's something else Bruh. <laughs> but anyways containment is really really good i used to want to like wake up just to watch it because it was so it had me so hope it's one is one season is one season but episodes is quite long so yeah and i think it's like what 16 some amount of episodes it's not it's not less than 10 episodes so you know you get a good amount in that one season so another one is which is not for children so please don't watch it if you under 18 don't watch this but it's she's gotta have it if you never hear about it you should go watch it she's gotta have it um i didn't know about the i actually no let me take that back i actually went and i watched the movie the old movie the first movie that they made this she's gotta have it it's a like a a remake i was gonna say spin-off it's a remake but in episodes so they break it down more but i watched the original the original original which was in like i was in like way old like black and white old was it yeah yeah so she's gotta have it is a good that's a good show i have really liked watching it i think i watched it like twice the whole thing twice um i watched the island twice 
I watched The Vampire Diaries and The Vampire Diaries have like seven, eight seasons, like a lot of seasons and a lot of episodes in a season. So imagine watching that like twice or three times. Another one is Dear White People. Now, I know it may sound a little, you know, harsh <laughs> or like bold, like Dear White People, you know? But it's, let me tell you, okay? It is kind of like a. Why am I telling you what it is about? Anyways, just go watch Dear White People. It's a really good, informative type. Of, it's kind of like grownish. So if you know about grownish, Dear White People is kind of like that, where they give you like real life, like real life, real deal, relatable stuff. You know what I mean? Like. The next one is On My Block. So if you hear people talking about On My Block, yeah, on my block, good girls, and all them stuff. On my block is another good show. I think the end is so stupid though, but yeah, on my block is a good show. They have three seasons, so if you never watch it, and the thing is, if I never watch these shows, something wrong. Cause yeah, everybody be talking about them. Something is wrong if you never watch them. And then my last one. <laughs> my last one is all american i literally just finished watching all american like two days ago and that is the show i actually stay up till three o'clock one morning and i don't stay up that late but I actually stay up like three, till three o'clock one i'm talking so okay i'm just trying not to like talking my accent but i want to keep my accent you know okay so i stayed up till three o'clock in the morning one night because i was determined that i was gonna finish watching this and i still didn't finish watching this you know because i was like i gotta go sleep and i don't go sleep early so <sighs> but anyways i did get up and finish watching it but all america is a really 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 good show it's it's really good like I'm waiting for the next season already. When you looking for shows on Netflix, look for something that will catch your eye. Like for me, like when I say I don't like people telling me what to watch, I want to see something and be like, ooh, I should watch this. And then if that show leaving you waiting for next season, and you know you waiting for this season to come, then you know it's a good show. If you want to see that video of Netflix movies, the ones that i think are you know really really good because i i do have some good taste in like movies and stuff like <laughs> so yeah so be sure to look out for the next video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel bye <laughs>